I'm afraid we have to talk about one very specific thing that is very different than other classes and it's related to the exam. And there is another video about the exam specifically, so you might want to check that out. And you might also take a look at the video about a reflection, because this is basically the exam. However, you know at the university you have to get, or you can get, you don't have to, but you can get 100 points for a straight A, for a perfect grade, a zero, a 1.0 in the German university system. But in this class, the grading consists of two parts. One part is the exam, and I already covered that. The other part is your attendance in class. So your attendance is being graded every time you are in class. And again, that is different than in most other classes. The reason why I'm doing that is that only with your participation, we can generate data behavior that we are able to analyze in our experiential learning setting in the here and now. And you might want to check out these two videos about experiential learning and here and now versus there and then if you haven't done that already. So I need your participation to generate data to be able to discuss something in class. So if you're not there, you cannot discuss, obviously. So this is why you will receive points for being there. But bad news, you don't just get points for being there. You get points for being there and actively participating. So if you talk just for the sake of talking, you will not get any points. So what can you do to get points? It's pretty easy and pretty difficult because I want you to help the class learn by providing new insights, by providing a provocative idea, by giving a new twist into the discussion and just be there and share how you feel, what you think, and what is annoying you at the moment. And I will talk about that in depth in the first session where we will meet. But please be aware, if you are not there, you cannot get any points. Just by being there and not actively participating, you are not guaranteed to get any points. You can ask me anytime how you are, how you're doing, what your points are, but please don't come like two days before the exam with 25 emails asking me because I suppose you know pretty well how you're doing. And by the way, I talked about experiential learning and that we are creating an organization ourselves. And this video or this video series is already part of the process that we are going to observe. So if you now try to feel a little bit. How does this video, specifically this one about the attendance, land on you? What kind of feelings come up? What do you think now about the organization? So it has already begun.